From the terrifying rules of the Tyrannosaurus Rex to the deadly stealth of Velociraptors, the Jurassic franchise has given us some of the most thrilling and unforgettable moments, but few things leave as big an impact as iconic death scenes. In today's video, we're counting out the top 7 most memorable human deaths in the Jurassic franchise. Taking off our list is Peter Ludlow, the corporate villain from The Lost World. After trying to exploit the dinosaurs for profit, Ludlow end comes in the form of poetic justice. Cornered in a cargo hold by a juvenile T-Rex, he's more than killed as a parent of the juvenile T-Rex watches proudly. This death was satisfying and he definitely had it coming. Ludlow's downfall highlights a franchise ongoing theme, no one can control these dinosaurs. Look at you. There's some kind of hot rod. <clears throat> Open the light. <laughs> In Fallen Kingdom, Ken Wheatley's arrogance is his ultimate undoing. The mercenary trophy hunter gets too close to the Indoraptor thinking it's drugged and harmless. Big mistake. The Indoraptor then messes with him, first biting his arm off, then killing him brutally. Wheatley's death serves as a reminder that underestimating these creatures, especially hybrids like the Indoraptor, is fatal. And the fact that the Indoraptor was playing with him before killing him is extremely scary. <laughs> Dyke Stark thought he could get away with mistreating tiny compies, but nature had other plans. As he's isolated in the jungle, the small seemingly harmless creatures swarm him, proving that even the smallest dinosaurs are deadly in numbers. Stark's death is particularly haunting because it shows how quickly things can escalate, even if the threat seemed minor. Seeing the trickling blood in the river was also a cool gruesome touch. Zara, Claire's assistant, becomes an unexpected casualty in Jurassic World. What stars as a pteranodon attack escalates into one of the most over-the-top death scenes in the franchise. She's grabbed, dropped in the Mosasaurus tank, and ultimately devoured. The sheer chaos and spectacle makes this scene unforgettable, leaving the audience shocked at the intensity of her demise. This shows how the creation of Jurassic World has de devastating effects on everyone. Eddie Carr's death is one of the most heartbreaking in the series. As he struggles to save the others, his bravery is met with a gruesome end, being torn apart by not one, but two T-Rexes. His sacrifice is noble, making his death even more impactful, especially since he had no ulterior motives, he just wanted to help.
Jurassic Park's most notorious saboteur, Dennis Nedry, met his match in the form of a Dilophosaurus. After trying to steal embryos to make a quick buck, Nedry's death is both terrifying and poetic. The venom spitting dinosaur blinds him before going for the kill. It's a satisfying end for a character driven by greed and one of the franchise's most memorable deaths. Muldoon's death scene is iconic, not just for the execution, but what it reveals about the Velociraptor's intelligence. His infamous clever girl line just before he is ambushed is seared in Jurassic Park fans' memories. The fact that the park's top game warden couldn't outwit the raptors shows just how deadly and intelligent they truly are. And there you have it, from shocking spectacles to emotional sacrifices, the deaths in the Jurassic franchise are as memorable as the dinosaurs themselves. Which death do you think was the most shocking? Did your favourite make the list? Let me know in the comments below.